It's rainy, feeling like Batman basically. Um, gonna go do some deadlifts, probably. I honestly, I don't know how it's gonna go because for the past few weeks I've only been deadlifting once a week. And I don't know if that's gonna help me or hurt me exactly. I mean, in the long run, it's definitely better and just kind of puts a little less stress on my back. I know I kind of said last video that I had post in like a week and a half, but it's spring break and I didn't really account for that. So it's probably a little, I probably failed on that promise, unless I somehow get this video up in like two days. But it's a thought that counts, guys. I'll try not to make promises I can't keep. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go do some deadlifts. I'm gonna take some bucked up. Gonna take this, gonna drive to the gym. I'll see you guys there. Thursday, October 31st. The city streets are crowded for the holiday, even with the rain. That was a pretty decent moving 405. Sometimes with like deadlifts, it's really hard to kind of get a feel of how it moves and how quick it moves and how well your form is without uh, like watching a video of yourself doing it. Cause it didn't feel great, but then I watched it and I'm like, that's actually a pretty decent set. 
I think even though it still moved fast, there's like a difference between speed and good form. And I think I kind of lacked the form. And I think it's kind of reasonable considering I, I've just kind of been lacking on deadlifts lately. But as long as I'm hitting a clean 405, I'm pretty happy because that was like such a huge goal. Uh, when I started deadlifting and just lately like it's only been a few months since I hit 405 the other reason that I've Been kind of chilling out on deadlifts is because I've started doing hook grip over the past uh, About a month and if you don't know hook grip So oh, if this is the deadlift bar hook grip instead of going like this or like this you're gonna tuck your thumb in and then wrap your fingers over it so that when you pull, it's just gonna kinda tighten itself. My, my thumbs have gone destroyed. I can't really show it right now, so I had to kind of relax a bit so I could like let my thumbs heal. If you guys watch some of my like earlier videos, you'll notice I do a mixed grip. Um, and then about a month ago, I started like fully committing to hook grip. So it's harder, but in the long run, it's better. So that's what I've been doing. You don't do whatever feels best for you honestly, because hook grip's kind of, like I said, hook grip is really tricky to get, like, used to, but in my experience, I, I like it more. So, yeah, I'm going to go do back and biceps right now. I'll see you guys. Okay, so that was like a, it was kind of a mid-workout. Like I got pretty fatigued. Um, I don't think I got enough food today, but that's how it is. You know, like not every workout's gonna be crazy. It's never gonna be linear growth. You know, like you're always gonna have bad workouts, but as long as you're moving in the right direction and you're getting in there and you're working hard, like it doesn't matter. Um, I think now that I've kind of hit my goals for like bench and deadlift, I don't worry about the numbers as much. Like, I'd, I guess the best way to put it is I don't ego lift as much. But yeah, you know, it was a workout. We got in, we got a 405. Um, that's that. I'm gonna head home and I'll see you guys there. So now that like daylight savings is over, it's like bright at eight o'clock now, which is really weird because on top of daylight savings and winter, it used to get dark, like pitch black at about 6.30. So now I don't have to deal with that, which is kind of nice. It feels good to get some sunlight and, you know, not have four hours of sunlight in the day. Um, but that's it for the video. Uh, I'm not going to say that I'm going to upload extremely quick because I don't know if I can do that, you know, I'm just super busy right now, but I'm gonna do my best to make good videos for you guys and to 
you know, make work that I'm proud of because I don't think anything bugs me more than like going out and filming and doing a workout and, f you know, making something that I don't genuinely like. So I promise you guys that I will always be, you know, trying to improve and just make better stuff for you and for me because I take pride in my work and it's not something that I just throw together. So I appreciate all the support and if you guys have any questions like regarding anything like what I eat, what workouts I do, uh, you can just go follow my Instagram. It's the same handle as my YouTube. Just search me up and you can DM me. I'll respond to all those. Um, so if you have any questions about camera gear or pre-workout or you know anything, just hit me up. But yeah, that's going to be it for the video. Uh, I appreciate the support on all the videos. Um, if you're new, consider subscribing if you like the video. Um, yeah, hit the like button, comment for the algorithm and all that. And I'll see you guys later.